weeks fly by and today it's time for yet another vlog. Um, a little bit early this time. Yeah. Uh, it's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday. I'm going on a conference next, next week, uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, so we are recording this on fr this Friday mm -hmm. instead. Um, you are now probably working on the second or have started working on the second assignment in the course. We had a deadline for the first assignment uh, a couple of days ago, Wednesday. Mm -hmm. uh, we will look at the first examination assignment, of course. However, we are fully stuck with uh, examinations in another course right mm -hmm. now. So, so we need to, to like postpone the assessment of, of, of the first assignment until the first assignment in the other course is finished because that is one week ahead. Um, but we will look at, at, at uh, the assignment and you will get feedback on it as an issue on GitHub. Um, we have recorded lectures. Well, we should mention the release thing, I think. Yeah, oh, don't forget to make a release on the first uh, assignment if you have finished it. Always make a release when finished and that is, otherwise we will not look at the assignment. We will not assess it until you've made a release. Uh, we had a lecture this week, actually two parts, mm -hmm. uh, about um, uh, uh, persistent data sessions in Express, mm -hmm. flash messages. Uh, so you can go ahead and look at that if you like. If you're a Swedish student, the Swedish version should work just fine. Yes. We have uh, made small changes, small, 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 small changes, but they are so small that it doesn't really matter. It's just some kind, some some naming. small, yeah, some some naming yeah. conventions and a really small update concerning the frame, the Mongo's framework. I yeah. Think. yeah. Uh, and. Um, we are not discussing more complex data sets where, where you have like child schemas and things like that. And Jan has a recording that you can look if you if you want to to dive into using more complex data sets. Uh, uh, and you will need this lecture, of course, for the second assignment, mm -hmm. as well as the, the the following lectures concerning security because that is one big part in, in, in that assignment as well to make the applications uh, application secure and well uh, it's about like access control access control as well authenticating the user and authorizing the user for certain uh, um, resources, resources. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and I think that we have some kind of security in that one as well right oh, or is it know. the third one the third one I think Yeah, it's actually the third one. Um, yep, but well, well, you, you need to, to take care of the passwords. And so yeah, 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 yeah. You, you may so, that course. part needs to be secure at least. So, so we will discuss that in next week's lecture. Um, haven't heard much from Rafael. I think it's everything is like progressing. So, so some of you are. Uh, all, have already started working with passwords yeah. and working with passwords we are using a module called bcrypt or we used to <laughs> we used to okay mm. yeah 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 <laughs> we used to and there is a problem with windows right yeah yeah uh, but but just for windows users but, and and uh, 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 a pretty good a good substitute is a uh, 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 package called bcrypt js uh, had so use that instead. Yeah, um, we will probably oh. mention that on the lectures as well. Yeah, so yeah, sure. And we will update the uh, projects. Yeah, package JSONs to yep. use that one. Yep, yeah. And then you will not. I think was it a dependency on the bcrypt that failed or something? Like yes. That? It was about. It's about uh, on Windows. We need to compile the bcrypt with. Uh, it, it's it's I think it's a uh, implementation in C or so, okay. and you need to compile it, and you, you need additional packages. But with uh, Bcrypt JS, you know, there are, there are no other dependencies, so it's pretty straightforward to, to use that one. Yep. Um, so 
bear that in mind and, and some of you noticed that in Slack as well. So mm. there is help to get. Mm. Other than that, it's, I think it's quite straightforward. Start working on the second assignment. Yep. There will be an oral hearing for that one. Uh, and the time slots for, for that oral hearing will be not be released this week, the week 49. It will be the week after, week 50, uh, I would guess somewhere in the middle, like Wednesday. Or an right, exercise to look into before looking into Ooh, the that's second assignment. That's a good question. Um, follow the route, we looked at no, pure, pure approval. Pure approval, definitely. That one, yeah. yeah. Uh, is it a solution regarding authentication as well? Oh, or nope. Nope, that's finding Waldo is even there's callback. Got no exercises on there. Uh, yeah, so it's actually the pure pure, pure approval is, is the last exercise yeah. to, to, to... So take a look at that one yep. if you haven't. Yep. Uh, there are solu solution proposals as well that you can find if you if you want to see a solution. Mm. Solution. There are many, of course, but that is just something that follows the structure that we have used in the course. Okay, and with that, we will uh, wish you all a pleasant weekend. My weekend will be sleeping uh, on a sleeping pad on on a, on a big hall at Dreamhack, mm -hmm. uh, sitting at a small chair in a, <laughs> at a small table for. Three days or something like that. So, so mm -hmm. if you you are uh, uh, visiting DreamHack, please come visit me on row D forty eight. Well, maybe we'll, I'll see you there. There, otherwise we'll see you next week at Friday as well. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Bye.